Thank you, Mr. President. In December of 2014, uh, Judge Haynes of the Middle District of Tennessee assumed senior status, creating a vacancy uh, on the Middle District bench. That vacancy has resulted in increased caseloads for the three active federal district judges, Judge Sharp, Judge Campbell, and Judge Trauger. Fortunately, Mr. President, help is on the way. In June, Senator Corker and I had the pleasure of introducing Waverly Crenshaw to the United States Senate Judiciary Committee when it met to consider his nomination. I was pleased that the committee agreed with us. They reported out his nomination by voice vote the following month. It's easy to see why Tennesseans support Mr. Crenshaw and are excited about his nomination and the prospect that the United States Senate will confirm him tonight. He was born in Nashville, and then he stayed, attending Vanderbilt University both for college and for law school. After law school, he clerked for Judge John Nixon in the Middle District of Tennessee, the same court where we hope he will soon serve. After his clerkship, he worked for the Tennessee Attorney General before entering private practice. In 1987, he became an associate of a small labor and employment law firm in Nashville, and in 1990, he joined one of our largest firms, Waller, Lanston, Dorch, and Davis, where he's currently a partner. Mr. Crenshaw is also active in the Nashville community, serving as unpaid legal counsel to the National Convention and Visitors Corporation, the Tennessee Independent Colleges and Universities Association, and the YWCA, among others. The Middle District of Tennessee is fortunate to have such a well-qualified nominee. Waverly Crenshaw is a man of good character and of good temperament, and today I encourage my colleagues to vote for his confirmation. <laughs>